This is an interesting little cemetery that, unfortunately, is no longer open to the public as far as I can tell. I'm happy to be wrong about that, but there doesn't seem to be any way to get in here without scaling a fence or <laughs> having a key. It has this impressive gate. It's connected, this is the, the St. Uh, sorry, <laughs> the St. George Churchyard, I believe is the, the official name of the cemetery. And that's the St. George Church. But even, even through entering through the church, I don't think there's any way to get into the, into the yard. There are a lot of real interesting names from Astoria history buried here. There's uh, some of the Blackwells are here. Uh, the Tisdales, or I can't, I can't remember any, some of the others off, offhand. An interesting little place though. And this one, for some reason, is facing toward the, toward the street. I don't remember this. Wish I could get in and show you more to go. Maybe I'll just put together a slideshow with the pictures I got a long time ago. And this is where I used to be able to to get in. But as you can see, it's locked. You can see a little bit, I mean, you can basically see the whole thing, but you can't get too close. My understanding is that this is still an active cemetery. People still have plots waiting for them when they die. We can't get any closer than this, but things change.